Pagan channel. I'm your local friendly sweet witch, uh, Serpentina Soul or Serpentine, whichever. <laughs> um, and so today we are going to talk about, uh, besides the daily tarot as well as uh, the goddess wisdom of the day, uh, we're also going to talk about what is moon water and ways to decorate your moon water bottle. <laughs> so today's tarot is the reverse. Ace of Cups. So the reverse Ace of Cups means uh, you need to pay attention more to self-love, uh, taking care of what you need at home, uh, being appreciative of what you have. Um, you're you're not doing those things uh, as as well as you might be struggling with possible depression or you're struggling with. Uh, self self esteem issues in some way. <clears throat> um, it can also mean uh, you're just down in the dumps in general. You're you just been sad lately. <clears throat> so the goddess wisdom of the day has something to uh, possibly help you with that. Pele, divine passion. Be honest with yourself. What is your heart's true desire? So pretty much like you want you are a creative person. You you either want to be active, you you want to have a healthier lifestyle, uh, you're tired of feeling this way all the time. But um but you know, you just been sad. You something's been in your way. You, like you, you you just been struggling is all. Well, you know, you know what burns your your passions. You know what gets your your boat running. <clears throat> so, it, either if it's poetry or working out, or like if you have animals for the sake of your animals, or if you have kids, same thing, or a partner. But but uh, you know, just a little bit can change your whole day. You can put on some good music in the background and just clean up your apartment or just say mantras that you are a good person. You you are a positive influence. <clears throat> um, and it's okay if you need help. There's no shame in that. <clears throat> and, you know, that passion, asking for help is showing that, like, you're, you don't want to give up. Like, you, you need help, but you don't want to ask for it. It's like you're a little bit hard headed, so it could it could be that. <clears throat> um or you've just been possibly because of the sadness, you've been lacking in your uh in your passions lately. You know, uh regardless if it's dance, poetry, uh art, whatever you may do. So it's okay. Your week's gonna get better. I have a good feeling about that. <clears throat> so what is moon water? Um, speaking of which, uh, get it, which, <laughs> but anyway, okay, so moon water is water that you keep, uh, outside under a full moon or whatever room, uh, whatever moon that it may be. Uh, to soak up the moon's properties and the moon's energies. It has to be uh, filtered. to be uh, water, so it can be safe. <clears throat> um, so you could go online and look up the different properties on what uh, the different moon energies brings in. Uh, I do I do know that full moon brings in a lot of uh, blessings and for some people a cleanse. Um. <clears throat> Uh, but, uh, what is moon water used for? Uh, you may ask. Well, moon water is used for, uh, for manifesting and also used for a deep spiritual cleanse, uh, as well as, uh, other spiritual folk or, uh, witchy people, um, and their spell work and using whatever phrase of the moon those energies and that spell work helps too. 
So, uh, how to decorate your moon water bottle. <laughs> or not water bottle, but it is a water bottle. <laughs> um, so, you don't have to have a fancy glass bottle like this. Uh, whatever you can do, what, whatever, it, use what you have. It is my personal mantra that I really like it in my uh, craft. <clears throat> um, you can even use a water bottle. You know, throw some stickers on to there. Uh, de decorate it with like um, rhinestones or something, like the blue on ones. Even take some gel pens, whatever you want to do. Uh, like my ex-mentor used to say, uh, you do you, boo. You might find her on here. But, um... <clears throat> So how I decorated my moon water bottle is uh, I glued this blue marble on top for the elements of water. Uh, I did two bracelets, one with a pentacle and and attached with an amethyst uh, crystal. Uh, the other side is a uh, the triple moon symbol with an onk attached with a pentagram in the middle. <clears throat> Uh, the difference between a pentacle and a pentagram. Pentagram is without the circle. It's still a symbol of protection. And a pentacle is a um, is is the pentagram with the circle. And both are symbols of protection and used in uh, in one's craft. <clears throat> um, you know, you might there there might be some people who think otherwise, but there's a difference between a intervert uh, inverted pentacle or pentagram than just a regular uh, pentacle or pentagram. <clears throat> um, again, your path is your own, and I'm not here to judge, I just gotta respect your magical journey. Um, <clears throat> this is something that my ex-mentor taught me as well, which is a wonderful saying. But anyway, uh, inside, I also decorated a thing that I got for Yule this past uh, Yule tie season. Uh, it's like a hand sewed uh, pentacle, so I grew I glued that on the outside. So, and it, it's just like simple little touches that that I did to this like little glass bottle. That that's what I did. Um, I got the bracelet making stuff um, from actually old like uh, mesh back that I got from like jewelry stores or something so that's how I made the bracelets and uh you know super glue can be a witch's uh best friend especially if you're the crafty type where you like to make things and uh glue things together <laughs> so um that's his moon water and uh how to decorate your moon water bottle as well as the tarot um, please follow me on Instagram at Purple Pagan, um, and please like and uh, please like and subscribe. Uh, I look forward. Uh, mention any witchy pagan topic, and I'll uh, I'll share my experience with it uh, as well as if it's something that I've never done before. I'll do my history and kind of let you guys know what the history is, because so sometimes I understand that you you don't want to do all the work because you're just so busy if you have work or kids at home <clears throat> um, or you just forget uh, so I will give you a little bit on that history as well so uh, yeah please like and subscribe and uh, see you next time classmates